These are Tunisian journalists on strike. They are protesting against the imprisonment of Ziad El Hani, a journalist charged with defamation after going live on TV and accusing the general prosecutor of corruption. He spent three days in jail, something the journalists' union says is unacceptable. But this is about more than the case of one man. Tunisian journalists are afraid they will lose the freedoms they won after the 2011 revolution. We thought that the revolution brought to us freedom of speech and expression, but it turns out that journalists' intellectual and physical safety is under threat. In the past week alone, three journalists have been taken to court because of things they have said. One journalist is accused of threatening national security. Since the Tunisian revolution more than two years ago, there has been an explosion of media in the country. But the laws that existed under the previous regime have not changed. Journalists are treated like criminals. If found guilty, a journalist risks a long jail sentence. Fahim Boukadous is a journalist who was jailed under former President Ben Ali and was released after the popular uprising of January 2011. Today he says media freedom is under threat. In the past 10 months, we have an average of three to four criminal prosecutions against journalists, even though we have a post-revolution law that prevents that. But the judiciary isn't using it. In the past few months, dozens of journalists have been prosecuted and threatened. The Ministry of Justice would not comment on these cases. But the Journalists' Union and their members will continue to protest until their demands for press freedom are met. Yusuf Geji, Al Jazeera, Tunis.